Hello and welcome back to the annual Croctober collaboration hosted by Jenny's Scratch Made Kitchen and Tony over at Kettle Kitchen. All the ingredients and the playlist will be listed in the description box below. So let's get started on making mine. I'm going to do a beef dumpling soup. This is a totally new recipe and I got this from a cookbook that I purchased off of Amazon. Fix it and forget it. And it has over 1400 slow cooker recipes. And I have rinsed my beef stew one pound. Let's get the meat in. We got the meat. We're going to add one package of onion soup mix. I will have the link to the playlist down in the description box below. It is on six cups of warm water. Two carrots. Here is the heart of celery. I use the same thing. That's why my celery looks a little funny. Just saying. Add our tomato. One tomato chopped up. We are going to put the lid on this. We're going to let this cook for four to four hours. I'm probably going to turn it up a little bit because it is getting late. And once this gets to cooking and the meat is tender, then I'll bring you back and show you the next step. All right. <clears throat> Soup is good. The meat is tender. Now, <clears throat> I'm going to, to take a bag of this complete biscuit mix. I'm going to put it in my little saucepan. Going to add my fresh parsley. Going to mix this up. Add some buttermilk until it's just. We're going to drop these into the pot of soup. Everything will be listed in the description box below, along with the ingredients to the recipe and the link to the Fix It and Forget It book if you are interested. So I want to thank you, Jenny and Tony, for inviting me to this awesome collaboration. And I want you all to know there will be a giveaway on November 2nd, um, but to make sure that you are following along with the right collaboration and that your comment counts, look for the logo. This soup is really, really good. The only thing that I would do different for this, considering my husband and I are meat eaters, uh, it called for one pound of beef stew meat. I would definitely add a more Please, y'all, go down there and go check out the uh, playlist. There are some amazing recipes in this collaboration. And it might give you some ideas or some recipes you want to try.